Montego Bay, Jamaica, on August 5, 1972, Theodore Whitmore is one of, if not the most popular reggae boy from the 1998 FIFA World Cup. When it relates to Theodore Whitmore's success with the Jamaican national team, it was on November 7, 1993, that 21-year-old Theodore Whitmore made his debut for the Jamaican national team. Theodore Whitmore would score his debut goal against Cuba in a 2-1 loss in the 1995 Caribbean Cup. He would then score his second goal for the country two days later in a 1-0 win over Trinidad and Tobago, but that wasn't enough to help the team to advance from the group stage of the competition. In the 19 World Cup qualification matches that Theodore Whitmore played leading up to the 1998 World Cup, he scored a total of five goals. In the three matches that the midfielder played in the World Cup in 1998, he scored two goals, both of which was against Japan in the 39th and 54th minute, which aided Jamaica to their first ever win in the competition. After the World Cup, Theodore Whitmore then took part in the Caribbean Cup, in which he would score a brace in the first match against Cayman Islands. Jamaica would go on to win the tournament for their second time in history. On March 13, 2003, Theodore Whitmore would play his 100th match for Jamaica, which they lost 1-0 to Cuba. Theodore Whitmore would play his final game for Jamaica on November 17, 2004, in a 1-1 draw against the United States. Whitmore played a total of 120 matches for Jamaica and scored an impressive 24 goals, which includes four braces. Theodore Whitmore will go down as not only one of the greatest midfielders in Jamaican history, but also one of the most accomplished representatives that Jamaica has ever had on the big stage. Remember to subscribe and hit the bell icon for your notifications. Like, comment and share for more fantastic videos.